but like with with the Yeezys, whenever they whenever they come out and they sell out, you know, they resell for like two, three thousand. You know, what are your thoughts on like a sneaker, even if it's not a Kanye West sneaker? Like sneakers having like a crazy resale price after they sell out. Nah, the sneaker game is retarded right now. It's a whole new hustle. It's it's it's, it's, it's become a, a money maker for a lot of people. So you know. It, 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 it's kind of dope, man. You know what I mean? Like, shit. Fuck it. Don't knock the hustle, man. Could you see yourself paying that much for a sneaker you really wanted? I don't know about it. Depends on what the event was. If the event was right, it depends on what I was doing. No telling if it's, if, if it's the right event and you got to stun on a couple people. You might just pull them out. So, well, what's the most you'd ever spend on a sneaker? That the most I ever spent on a sneaker. Yeah. Um, I think I spent like 700 on them Supermans. Uh, is it a pair of Jordans? The Fours. The Fours, okay. Turn back the Fours. Right. Mm-hmm. I think I did those. Mm -hmm. I don't think I ever spent $1,000 for a pair of Jordans, though. For the pack, I spent $1,000 for the... Uh, for the gold pack with the sixes and the um and the uh, yeah and, uh, and the space jam, I spent a stack for that. But that, you know, I mean, that's two pairs of sneakers in there and stuff like that. Like, as much as I, I love sneakers, I don't really jump out the box and shit like that. You know what I mean? Like I ain't. I'm still a modest dude. They gotta be really something that a nigga need that I know is going is gonna be worth it. Maybe he saved up a little money and found a connect. He actually made up this whole story about he how he had a friend who had a store who had a connect. Mm -hmm. And I go upstairs and I'm like, hey, where am I at? And I look and I'm looking on the shelves and I don't see him. But I have so many sneakers. I'm thinking, oh, I must have put them somewhere else. Why do I feel rappers' sneakers come and go? I think because their fans are the consumer. You know, when your fans are the consumer, when your record is hot, they're going to buy it. When your record is not hot, they're not going to buy it. 